So, Evan and Leah, what has been the best bit of English so far this year in Year 8? For me, it was doing the TalkBot presentation because it was helping us study uh, speaking and listening. And it was very fun to do and make up your own speech and try to add some humour to it as well to make your class laugh. Good. What word means, quiet please? Extremely happy. Contented, gratified, elated or cheerful. The best fit for extremely happy. Three, two, one. Back section first. And 19 if you got it right, that was trickier. Elated is extremely happy. Gratified and contented and cheerful. They're happy but not extremely happy. It's elated that's the best fit answer. Leah? Uh, my favourite was when we had to write a story. It was actually a test but I found it really fun and we had to write about something that happened to us in the past and I found it really fun. And what did you write about Leah? Um, I wrote about when I was um, really young and I knocked Mickey Mouse over in Disneyland. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I love reading, so I find Accelerated Reader a great way to track how many books and words I've read. Accelerated Reader also helps me to decide which book I should read next, and it sets targets that I aim to achieve each term. This year we had the opportunity to take part in creative writing workshops with a published poet. We also had the chance to enter our poems into a competition that gave us the chance to have our work published too. On our assessments, such as creative writing and poetry, we are marked and given personal targets for improvement. This way, we can know what we did well and know what we can what we can improve on for further assessments. In Year 10, we do regular vocab tests, which are really helpful for increasing your vocabulary. I've gotten full marks so far in all of them. This year in Year 10, we read the book Roll of Thunder, Hear My Cry. I quite enjoy this book because I find it's a thrilling read and it's very educational. 